So one of the questions that I get from you guys is asking me, can you use white hair products on your black hair? And the answer to that is yes, you can use any product that you want. The difference between white hair products and black hair products is that black hair products tend to be a lot more moisture based than white hair products and that's because the natural oil that grows out of our scalp, sebum, it doesn't flow to the ends of our hair and so our hair tends to be a lot more drier than that of a white person or a person with straight hair and so you can use any product that you want. Um, a few product lines that I like to use is Pantene Herbal Essence. Um, I like to use Tresemme as well and these products work great for my hair. It's all about finding products that help to support your hair needs. It's not really about white hair products and black hair products. It's about finding products that work for your hair. Now this is just a generalization of black hair and white hair. I am very well aware that a black person can be born with straight hair and a white person can be born with textured hair. It's just about using the products that work for your specific hair type. So the next thing is relaxed hair products versus natural hair products. I get a lot of questions from newly naturals. They just chopped off the relaxed hair and they want to know what products should I use? What products should I use? And two things that I always say, I always say use more moisture products, more moisture. And I always ask, well, what products do you already have? Because just because you went natural doesn't necessarily mean that you have to not use the products that you use when you are relaxed. The biggest difference that I've noticed with um, going natural, yes, you have to learn your hair all over again, but the biggest thing is just learning how to properly detangle and how to style your hair. As far as the moisture and protein balance, that is pretty much for any hair type, you always need moisture and protein balance. Some hair types more than others, but it's pretty much moisture and protein balance. So you don't necessarily have to just get rid of your hair products because you decided to go natural. Now natural products tend to be a lot more moisture based um, than relaxed hair products for the same reason why black hair products in general are more moisture based So relaxed lines usually they have a relaxer of course but the products tend to be protein based and that's to help support or to reverse any damage that was done for the relaxer and so if you're natural you can use those products because like I said all hair needs a balance of moisture and protein and I know I like to use RIS organic root stimulators replenish and conditioner that is consider a relaxed hairline, a relaxed hair product. And then I use that on my hair for protein, a light protein deep conditioning. One thing that I noticed about relaxed hair and natural hair products, um, I've seen plenty of blogs and videos that say if you're relaxed, don't use natural hair products. Again, you can use any hair product that you want. Um, natural hair products for relaxed hair has a rep of uh, being a little bit heavy because a lot of natural hair products are oil based and butter based and that might be a little heavy for relaxed hair but I know a lot of relaxed hair ladies that like to use the butter based and oil based products and just because a natural hairline or a product is, is, is targeted to natural hair doesn't mean that it's filled full of oils and butters. There are a lot of natural hairlines that are botanical based, herb based and um, can get your hair volume, can help to smooth your hair, and don't weigh your hair down. So that is pretty much what I think about black hair products versus white hair products and natural hair products versus relaxed hair products.